Um, are Katie and Jules LeBlanc still best friends? If so, do, do Katie and Jill have any plans of flying out to California to visit the LeBlancs this summer? Fantastic question. I know Katie's answered this several times. You guys keep asking because absolutely, we that's they were dear friends of ours when we were living in Maryland. They moved out to California and then we you know, we're in Maryland for a while and then moved to Florida. We are still friends. I'm still friends. I stay in touch with Katie and Katie stays in touch with Jules. Um, but as you guys can imagine, you know, they moved to California and it's not easy to get to California. Um, we, we, our lives got a little bit more complicated. We were going out there a lot for water polo and saw them, but now, you know, water polo and we don't go to California much anymore. And I don't believe they're coming out on the East Coast much anymore, but um, it's kind of a funny story. This is, this is a great background story. When, when Katie LeBlanc and I, um, became friends and became very friendly when the girls were doing gymnastics. At one point we had this conversation and we said to each other, listen, if you ever move away or if you ever move away, we'll probably never speak again. <laughs> because we both knew ourselves very well and we knew that we are not good keeper and touchers. So we were like, yeah, we'll always be friends. Like it's like we can pick up where we left off and that's how I am with everyone. I will pick up with you where I left off. I think of you a lot, but I am not a good keeper and toucher and neither is Katie. So birthdays, uh, Christmas, Easter, that kind of stuff, we, we reach out and... Um, and chat with each other. But other than that, you know, life gets busy and she's doing her thing and we're doing ours, but we still love them and I believe they still love us and um, and it's nice to follow their journey and hopefully they're following ours as well. We are still friends. I'm still friends. I stay in touch with Katie and Katie stays in touch with George.